Hello guys! Welcome back to my channel. My name is Savannah if you are new and today we are continuing our 100 baby challenge. I haven't filmed this in quite some time so I'm really excited to just get right into it. So why don't we do just that? Let's get into some gameplay. Okay guys, here we are back in the house. So I finally updated the 100 baby house. It has been long overdue. <laughs> that house was nasty to say the least. <clears throat> So I found this one off the gallery. I'm not 100% sure. I always forget to check who made it. But yeah, it's just a really um, basic starter home, I think. No, it was actually a hundred, one of the 100 baby houses. It was like one of the most popular ones. But I just used the shell and I completely like furnished it myself. Um, so come in here. It's very plain because as you guys know, we don't have a lot of money. So yeah, I found the fridge that you guys were talking about. Thank God. Hopefully it works. Um, I haven't tested it yet. We have some of our kids here. This is our very plain living area. Um, through here we have a bedroom. One of the bedrooms. Uh -huh. Was she crying or self woohooing? I don't know why my Sims like to do that like a lot. <laughs> so there's one of the bedrooms. Here's the master bedroom. And through here, there's just another bathroom. This is another bathroom. We got two bathrooms. Through here is like the toddler area. Through here is the playroom. So we've got everything with a pile of trash. <laughs> uh, I don't know why that easel is floating. What the heck is going on in here? But anyway, yeah, that's like the playroom. And then, come on, can you go a little faster? Sup, girl. Sup, girl. Everyone looks so miserable. Through here, I put the cauldron and the apple trees. Oh, it's so cute in here. I love it. We got some mac and cheese going on. We got our apple trees there. Um, a chess table and then like a little study area. I made this room but I haven't looked at it through this view yet. It's so cute. I love it. So yeah, that's the new house. I hope you guys enjoy it. Uh, it's a lot better than the other one. Hopefully it plays smoothly. So yeah, let me give you a little uh, recap here. So we have a full house right now. We're gonna move Jackson out because a lot of you guys were like, you need to move Jackson out, you're wasting time. And I'm like, okay, he like literally just got an A. But we're gonna move him out in this one. We've got Ramona, Primrose, Amira, Aurora, Theodore, and Harry. Okay, everyone has school. Lily is nice and passed out. What the heck is this? Crash here. Huh, I've never seen that before. Ever. No. No, no circus. Um, okay, Jackson, can you please come repair this? <coughs> One of the reasons why I didn't want to move him out, like, right away is because he is, like, a huge help around the house. Um, so, yeah, that's kind of why I wanted to keep him a little bit longer. But you guys are right, we are wasting time, so... Yeah, we're gonna move him out, and then, how are these girls doing in school? She's a B student. And is she responsible or anything? Yeah, she's responsible, so she just needs to get her grade up one more time, and then she's good to go. You, my darling, how are you? You're also a B student. Okay, so we need to get their skills to level three and then get them to be an A student. Is she responsible or anything? Yeah. See, responsibility is so freaking easy to do in this game. You just have to get your kids to just do their homework. <sighs> and everything's all good. All right, bye everyone. Have a great day at school. All right, this little bean is super tired, so I'm just gonna get him to go to sleep. Lily, what can you be doing? Why is it so dark? Oh, such a cloudy, cloudy, cloudy spring day. I need to fix this easel. It's really bugging me. Okay, perfect. Good night, love. Good night, good night, good night. I don't know. Is this the thing? Is this the right fridge? I hope it is. I really hope it is. 
can those regular sims even no oh my gosh that's not it unless we like make food and put it in there that's not the refrigerator Ugh. Retail freezer. I'm just gonna put it in the inventory for now just in case that is the right one, but we need a regular fridge. Otherwise, no one's gonna be able to eat. Okay, we still had our old fridge in our inventory, which is good. So I don't know, I don't know. Do you like make food here and then put it in here and then they can like grab it? I don't know. It's so dark in this game right now. Holy crap. Okay, let, let me see, let me see, let me see, let me see. Cook. Cook a party size of fruit salad. <laughs> Lee is here. She came to play on our gaming mat. It's the only reason anyone ever comes and visits us to use our gaming mat. Hey, I be heard you became friends with Harry Potter. He's pretty cool. Indeed. Okay, well, we'll put it in here. So let's see. I don't know, we'll see. We'll see if he can like grab it on his own cause that would be so clutch. And there's also poor quality mac and cheese in here that you guys say never goes off. So like, will we ever need to make food again? Cause this is here? Like, I don't know. That just seems crazy to me. Yes, who's calling? Why didn't you help me at school? What? What the heck does that mean? We are having a seasonal party, are you coming? What is going on here? I have slice of life, I have life decider, and I have... What else do I have right now for as far as mods go? Personality, please. I've got... I want to say that's it. Why did... This is like ridiculous. This happens in every single one of my series. And I'm just like, bro, why? <laughs> so inappropriate. Who doesn't have uh, their homework with them at school? And she stays from what? Being sad? Poor thing. Very sad from being bullied? No! This is from the new Slice of Life update. So you can either be popular, you can be invisible, you can be a uh, no, you could be um, bullied, um, you could be. Uh, I forget what the other one is, but it looks like poor Primrose is being bullied, which is really, really sad. This girl, oh, she's also being bullied. Ramona and Primrose are both bullied. And Jackson is invisible. We need to age him up. He doesn't need to be a teenager anymore. Girl, can you like go to bed? Why are you passing out? I don't know. Oh, it's Theodore and Harry's birthday today. That's what's up. So we can age them up too. Okay, I'm gonna get her to cook a cake. Look at all these options. We are strangers now. I okay, I don't care. Who even are you, dude? Good grades. Succeeding in school makes young Sims particularly happy. Okay, cool. I legit don't know why they keep passing out. Like their energy isn't even that bad. Some of these mods are very, very strange. Help, they're after me. What? <laughs> What the heck? I haven't I seen your face before on a police poster? Ken go what? No! Oh my I hate you. I hate you. I hate you! That was supposed to be for your brother's birthday, not for you to just take a freaking slice of. Hey, you, no. Have some fruit salad, not a cake. Why can't you have any of this? Don't, don't. Oh my god! I hate my life. 
No. No, we don't want a job. We just want to have kids forever, okay? Ooh, a zombie cake? Can we put, um... Can we put, um... Ew! Throw up! Gross! Can we put, um, candles on a zombie cake? Guess we'll find out. Why are you always naked? I just sent you some money. I thought you could use it. Why, though? You're not our dad. Okay, th I am just shook right now about everything that's going on. Add birthday candles to this cute little zombie cake. Aw, look at it. That's so cute! I think this is from the spooky stuff pack because I just got it, so... Makes sense. Add candles, please! Alright, now. Help blow out candles, Theodore. It's his birthday, so we're allowed, okay? Nobody come for me in the comments. <laughs> Alright, Theodore aged up. He is a geek. And the aspiration, I would like to randomize, but doesn't let me. Creative. Of course. Okay. He's a creative geek. All right. <gasps> Go ahead. Add candles. And then help blow out candles. Harry Potter! Harry's been asleep for a while. We wake him up. It's time to age up. It is time to age up. Here we go. <laughs> Boom. He is naturally thin. These Sims have a high metabolism, so they naturally lose weight faster than other Sims. Okay. Weird. And he's going to be a whiz kid. Okay. I can see it. Alrighty. Very cool. Jackson, it's your turn. What the heck were you happy from? Pleasant fumblings from self woohoo. Ugh. Everything in Slice of Life, it's not just like a little bit, it's like a lot. Like the whole sickness thing, the self woohoo. Oh my god, look! Harry aged up with these round glasses. What? How did you know, Sims? How did you know? He got scouting aptitude. All of your scouting ability makes makes future earnings of skills a little bit easier. But you were never a scout. We're doing that again. Lovable. These sims build romantic relationships fast because of how lovable they are. Random. So freaking random. Can you stop being naked? Seriously, Theodore. Like, so inappropriate. Okay, I'm gonna get you to add birthday candles again, and we'll just put it in the refrigerator. All right, now let's have a look at these beans in Create a Sim. I think it's so funny that Harry aged up with round glasses. Skiba, you move. Yeah, Skiba, you move. All right, Theodore. Who's your dad again? Oh my gosh, who's their dad? Okay, hang on, we have to check. We have to check. We have to check because. It only makes sense to keep both of the parents in mind, and when you don't know who the dad is... Kengo! Okay. Oh, okay, okay, okay. So, the other twins was not Kengo's daughters. Those were Daichi's... Yeah, no. No, oh my gosh, I don't even... Yeah, they're Daichi's daughter. Right? I am getting so confused. I'm gonna have to look at the family tree again. Alright, so... This hair actually isn't bad. You can have this hair. Um... That color's fine. I like these brows on you. Okay. And then... I'm pretty sure Kengo has blue eyes, so you can keep your blue eyes. But... Let's try some different ones. Pretty! I like those. Ooh! I like those too! Oh, we need skin details as well. <gasps> How could I forget? Oh, so cute. Did he have freckles? No. Okay. This is a really cute kid. Okay, so you are a geek and an artistic prodigy. So what do you want to wear? 
Just when I think Lily's kids can't get any cuter, she pops this fool out. You can just, um, dress pretty casual. Nothing too major. We'll wait until you're a teenager to decide your style. No earrings, though. Mm -mm. Alright, guys. Here's Theodore. Let's move on to Harry now. Harry also has blue eyes, so we can give him the same eyes as his brother. The hair... Not feeling the hair. I like this hair. I'm gonna go with that. And then as far as glasses go... I mean, the round ones are cool. They suit. Should we do brown? No, we'll do black. Okay. Alright guys, here's Harry. Super adorable. Like, I think these are probably my favorite twins so far. I just think they're so cute. I hope you guys like them too! <sighs> oh girl, oh girl, oh girl. Cute moment. Okay, let's resume this gameplay! So what I think we're gonna do is... I think it's time for you to go, boy. <laughs> that poor, poor, poor face of yours. Okay, well... I hate to do it, I hate to do it, but it's gotta happen. Jackson's gotta go. Even though he's so clutch because he freaking never sleeps, so... Alright. Where are you, Jackson? Bam! You can move in with... Ah, yes. Is this household full? Not quite! One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Now it is! Look, we can see everyone! Okay, so, refresher. Leah, Aiden, Brenton, Mia, Romeo, Violet with her lost hair, Veronica, Jackson, Aurora, Mira, Theodore, Harry, Ramona, and Primrose. This is everyone so far. It's funny to see everyone laid out like this. These three look so similar, it's crazy. What is going on here? She is not. <gasps> In bed with freaking Primrose? No, this is, yeah, Primrose, oh my god. I hate that, that's so gross. And why are you passed out? Crash here, what is that from? Because you're not even tired. <sighs> How are these doing? Come and water these. So we need y'alls to get your skills up to three. Video gaming's pretty high up there, so why don't you go ahead and play with Primrose so you guys can both get your skills up. You, what do you need to do? Get one skill to level four. Okay, um, mental. That's really, really, really easy to do. You're almost there. So why don't you just do your homework? I think I should get your mental up. Oh, you're too uncomfortable. Why don't you use the bathroom? Use the bathroom. And you're hungry. Okay, grab some mac and cheese and then do your homework. What about you, dear? You have your skill to level four already, so you just need to be doing your homework. This cauldron is gonna be a lifesaver, I can already tell. We like never have to cook anything. It's so bomb. Yay, homework complete! You guys need to do your homework too, please. Did you do yours yet? No, do it, do it, do your homework. Ramona has become the victim of bullying recently. The principal has put a lot of effort to prevent the issue. However, it is out of their control when students leave campus. That's really sad. Is there anything that we can do about that? You know what I also want to do? I thought it would be fun. Um, actually, we can't do it just yet. It's the life decider thing. So it, you click on a sim and it like decides their career. It decides they get like an extra trait and it gives them like some skill boosts um, and a job, I think. So once the kids turn into young adults, we can, like, do the life decider on them. We probably should have done it on Jackson before he left, but that's okay. It's all good. Are you helping him with his homework? Oh, how sweet. Do your homework, too. Ooh, and you have a school project. 
I'm gonna need you to do that. Do extra credit. Do extra credit. Hey, you have a project too. Mm -mm -mm. Good stuff. It seems like everyone's good. Like, nobody seems to be in, like, a really bad mood or anything. What are you up to? Oh, the dollhouse broke. Lily. <laughs> Come repair it. You know what? We can get pregnant again. What? Why am I lacking so hard? Who should we invite? Where did all of our romance go with all of these people? Have we had kids with Benjamin yet? I feel like we haven't. All right, he's next. Oh my gosh, $1,931 for this painting. Don't mind if I do. It's a masterpiece. It's fine, it's fine. Okay, let me just make sure that we haven't had any babies with this Benjamin Long character. Let me just make sure. So the parents of these boys is Kengo. The parents of them, Kareem. The parents of Veronica is Reed. The parents of these guys, Lauren. Who am I missing? Daichi. Okay, yeah, we have not had babies with Benjamin yet. So, hook up in bed, embrace, kiss neck. What else can we do? Can we try for baby? Oh, it's gonna be a love day baby. How sweet. Try for baby. You better say yes. That's what I'm talking about. And look, she's almost an elder. Seven days? <gasps> Ooh -wee. We better hurry up and keep it going, eh? Y'all, y'all, y'all gotta go to school. Go, go, go. All right, let's find out if you're pregnant. Take a pregnancy test. You are extremely fertile, so I, I have no doubts. You've never failed me before, so we'll see. Huh? Woo! That's my girl. That is my girl. Do we have lot traits? Do they ever change? Oh my gosh, we don't. Okay. Okay. We need this one. A lot of you guys said that getting twins and triplets aren't, isn't a good thing, but I think it is. I know it's like harder to raise them when there's so many of them, but it just goes faster. Okay, what else can we do? Um, better schools. Where's that one at? Good schools. The local school is great. Kids seem to have get higher grades and usually do better with homework. Yes. And then kids just seem to learn faster here. Yeah, that's good. That's good. Okay. Good stuff. Guess what? I'm pregnant and you're an elder, so you're gonna die soon. <laughs> oh, these kids are going to be interesting looking, for sure. I mean, like, look at this guy's face. Oh, lava! <laughs> Guess we'll see! This house is so dark. Stop! What the heck? I did not tell you to do that! This mod is wild in. Hey, look. <laughs> <laughs> oh, good old love day. Okay, Leah's calling, but she's using our gaming mat. I'm confused. And we got mail. Stop! Oh my god, it's so inappropriate. You really had woohoo with my best friend? You are gross. Poor girl. Do I want to go on a date? No, what? Absolutely not. One and done with you, fool. Okay, what do we get in the mailbox? Starter flowers, starter vegetables, more toys, which we're gonna sell because we don't need any more. Okay, did anyone get better grades? Okay, Harry's now a B student. Theodore's a B student. Amir is an A student and Aurora. Nice, so we can age them up. Let me see, hold on. 
She's responsible and she's got an A. Okay, great. So let me just pop out this cake. Boom, okay, darling, come blow them out. I'm so excited to see what she looks like. And then Aurora, A student, responsible. They can both age up. So stoked. Your face looks like a cow plant. That's really mean. All right. She's a quick learner and hates children. Okay, and her aspiration is going to be bodybuilding. <laughs> that is so weird. But okay, sure, 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 sure. That's fine. Can you add candles for your sister? Your face looks like a cow plant. This Liam Galloway person is really mean. Come on, it's your turn, my little Disney princess. Same. All right. Wait, what was Aurora's trait before? Oh, it must have been a child trait, a child only trait, okay. So she's gonna be unforgettable. These sims leave a mark on everyone that they meet. It's hard to forget someone like this. And vegetarian, that's so cool. Okay, let's see what her aspiration is. <laughs> Spellcraft and sorcery. All right, cool. <laughs> All right, let's check them out in create a sim. I'm so excited. You, stop. Stop, 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 stop. And let me remind myself who their dad is again. Oh my gosh, look. Disliked. Their dad is Daichi. Okay. Daichi, Daichi, Daichi. This episode is so much fun. I don't know why. I love this outfit. Oh, pretty. This is Aurora. Okay, Aurora, you had long blonde hair, so we're gonna keep that going. Oh my god, that hair is crazy. Ooh, I haven't used this one yet. She had this hair as a kid, so maybe we can give her this one. Okay, and then, let's see here, yeah, what skin detail? This one is so pretty, we're gonna do that. Perfect eyebrows. Um, I'm pretty sure she had blue eyes when she was younger, right? I think so, because Daichi has blue eyes. Okay, I like those ones. All right, lashes, lashes, lashes. Whoa, see her eyes are so small that even the smallest lashes look crazy on her. Those are pretty. Okay, we'll do those. All right, and I really love this outfit. I think I'm gonna keep it. I know it's not very Disney princessy, but who dresses like a Disney princess when they're a teenager? Actually, now that I think about it, probably a lot of people. <laughs> I'm just gonna put her in this. I don't even care. I do not care. I love it. A little flats. Boom! There's Aurora! I hope you like her. Okay, let's move on to Miss Amira. She hates children and she wants to be a bodybuilder, which I think is so funny because she has like the skinniest body type that you could possibly have in The Sims. Not really sure what's going on with this um, makeup, but you guys are definitely not... What do you call it when you're exact twins? You guys are definitely not exact twins, so. You had black hair with bangs, it was long. Do we wanna keep that going? I actually really liked it on her. Maybe she could have this hair. I've been wanting to give it to someone, I just don't know who. I think it looks pretty good on her. And she's got yellow eyes, which I think is really awesome. I'm gonna give her a piercing, why not? Why not? Why not take a crazy chance? No. Why not do a crazy dance? Like this video if you know that song. 
Okay. I freaking love her already. She's awesome. Where are the lashes? There we go. Yeah, she has tiny eyes too. I think we'll give her... Yeah, let's just do those ones. Are your eyebrows black? They are. Okay, good. And then as far as skin details go... I kind of like the big eye bag look on her. It suits, it suits her. It does. Ooh, look at that. I'm normally more of like a Maxis Match skin details person, but... I like her with alpha skin. This one. I like that. Okay, would she wear eyeliner? Oh, dang. Dang, dang, dang. Ooh. <laughs> okay, I'm having way too much fun with her. Yellow, maybe? Oh my gosh, that looks so sick. Ooh, blue? <gasps> Alright. Yeah, that looks tight. Okay. What would she wear? I assume she would wear something like super... Super edgy. <laughs> now I don't feel like the bodybuilder aspiration suits her at all, but whatever. I mean, you could look like this and still be into bodybuilding. Maybe she could just wear this. I mean, it's kind of gym-like, but it's also very, um, it's like, I don't know how to explain it. It just goes. It just goes. I'm gonna just put her in some leggings. I think that's good enough. And as far as shoes go, definitely the chunky Y ones, for sure. Hmm. All right, gang, here's Amira. She is so cool and just like different looking. I'm so obsessed. Okay guys, now that we don't have toddlers anymore, we can go ahead and put the toddler beds away. For now. Uh, uh, uh. And we need more of these beds. Ugh, they're so pricey. Such a lovely rainy day. I love it. I love it. I love it. I love it. Whose school project is this again? This one was Aurora, so this one's Amira's. Can I eat lunch with you? Dang, Amira's already getting guys wanting to date her. I don't blame her, she's so pretty. Yay, Theodore completed his homework. Do extra credit now. <laughs> Uh-oh, it looks like Primrose has a bladder infection. <gasps> Good old slice of life. Gotta love it, am I right? No one had a good time on love day. You know what? It is what it is. You need to be working on your skills. Logic is pretty high. Go ahead and keep doing that. Aurora doesn't have jack crap for skills. She just needs to keep playing video games because that's like the easiest skill to get up. Really? Why is it always talk like a pirate day in my series? I can't escape it. <laughs> Someone's self wooing over here. Who is it? Yay, Aurora's responsible! Good girl! What trimester are you in, Lily? Third trimester in 23 hours. That's very exciting. Stop with the bullying! Oh my gosh! I can't even believe bullying is a thing anymore. Like, wait, who died? Terrible dream. Dreaming about the death of someone you care about can be really sad. Oh my gosh, that happens to me so often. So yeah, I definitely know how you feel. Okay, it looks like Aurora just got level 3 in her video gaming skill. So that means that she will probably get an A next time she goes to school, which is very exciting. This girl, she needs level 3 as well, so she's working on that. She's almost there. What is this? <gasps> We're going. We're going. It's so rare that you get invites to 6M. Oh my gosh. I have been trying to do this in my Island Living series and I had to do so much work and now she's just going to be here without doing anything. Oh. Oh, she's too uncomfortable. All I need you to do is collect some stuff. 
Harvest some stuff. Why are these guys fine, but we're like dying? It's not fair. Ooh, I found an alien. That's what's up. What if we bought this moodlet solver? I wonder. We're gonna try it. Cause I want her to be good. So I'm gonna get her to drink this. Let's see if it like makes her feel better. Here we go. Really? It just like filled up her need bar, but it didn't get rid of these things. <sighs> All right, well, if she's just gonna keep throwing up, there's really no point in being here. Let's just go home. Return home, return home. Well, that didn't go the way I wanted it to. Let's see what we got while we were there. We got an orange topaz, 18 bucks. We got an alien, dark pink, dead pink whale. <gasps> What's that from? Let's do it again. You had fun at that event? Hardly. You had a horrible time. You're just throwing up. We'll just put him right here. Yay, we got an alien. Yay. And these unpolished geodes. Wait, no, don't place in the world. No, don't place in the world. No. Polish. 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 I'm just gonna sell them. We don't need them. Uh, did you get your video gaming skill up yet? Not quite. You need to keep doing it. It's a good thing I have this, um, Wolfium in here. Because it makes them so focused every time they come in this room. It's really nice. There she goes, she did it! That was so fast! And who left their homework on the desk again? What, is she being bullied at school? Oh my gosh, why is everyone being bullied? Joyful mean-spiritedness. Mean sims delight in being nasty to others? She's not mean though. That's weird. Okay, so everyone got their skills up, everyone did their homework, and everyone did their extra credit. So by the time they go to school and come back, a lot of them should have A's. So I'm stoked. This is going really well. Someone's having some peas, how cute. I'm gonna get Ramona to brew a potion of plentiful needs. So that everyone can have one. Hopefully it goes smoothly. She did it. She freaking did it. Bottle up all. Alright, now make some mac and cheese. So how many- four potions of plentiful needs. Let's just put one in everyone's inventory. Oops, wait. There you go. You get a potion of plentiful needs. You get a potion of plentiful needs. You get a potion of plentiful needs. You get one. Everyone gets one, except for Harry, because there's not enough. <laughs> Sorry, my boy. And she's like super duper pregnant. Excited for that. Your face looks like a cow plant. I hate these bullies. They're so mean. What trimester are you in? Give birth in question mark, question mark, question mark. That's a good sign. I cannot wait for her to give birth. We're gonna have another BB in the house. Who is this? Kengo e Wait, what? I know that ain't Kengo. That's not the right Kengo, is it? What happened to you? What happened to your hair? Has it always been like that? Okay, so everyone has school in a little bit. I think today, once everyone gets home from school, I'm going to invite all of the other kids over so we can have like <laughs> a little family reunion. Um, let's see, let's, let's bottle up all of these potions. Let's give one to everyone so that they can be happy at school today. Okay. So go ahead, drink that. You need one. Bam. 
Go ahead, drink. Go ahead and drink. Everyone have a potion for breakfast. Oh, what? You can't drink potions? Wow, the kids can't drink potions. That is so lame. Everyone did their homework. Everyone got their skills up. Have a great day at school, okay? Study hard. Make mama proud. All right. This girl. Extremely pregnant. Oh, there she goes. Okay, I think we might have the baby at the hospital. Because why not? Oh, cute. Struggle town. Okay. Have baby at hospital. Mm, let's just send her alone. There we go. Goodbye. Have me a baby. So this is going to be Benjamin Long's kid. And it's a boy. Okay. Okay. Let me see. Let me see. Where's my list of names? Let's do Clive. I love that name. Clive. Clive Potter. So she has a baby, comes home, and immediately starts woohooing. Okay. Okay, well, you definitely know how to parent. All right, mail has been delivered and we have bills, so why don't you go pay those, get the mail, cuddle the baby. She has been making really crappy paintings. Like, they're only worth like $200 and she's level, what is she? Level eight painting. Okay, whatever. Oh, look who's here with her bald head. Come on in. Don't struggle. I hate it when they struggle too much. I'm scared. Marty, I'm scared. All right. A student. A student. A student. A student. A student. A student. Wow. Okay, let me see who exactly we can age up. So, she's an A student. Is she responsible, though? Does she have anything? She's responsible, so we can age her up. Primrose, responsible. A student. You, I literally just aged you up, and we're gonna have to age you up again? No way. Wow, that's crazy. We're gonna have so many birthdays today. <laughs> All right, let's bust out this um, zombie cake. Invite over all of the kids. Ooh, there's another one in here too. All right, we got three cakes out. I'm gonna get Lily to plan a social event. Okay, hello everybody. You poor thing, you're missing hair. Maybe you choose to be bald. More power to you, honestly. Aww. Don't you dare. Now is not the time. Oh my gosh, the baby. Oh wait, I can do super efficient baby hair. All right, look at this nice party going on. Everyone's just chatting, it's Veronica. This is Veronica, right? Jessica, yeah, you look like an absolute Jessica, icon. Jessica. Mia, what the heck? I definitely did not give you this outfit, but whatever. Hey, look, there's a girl that always jogs by our house. And there she goes again. That's so funny. Okay, all right, let's start aging people up. Ramona, go ahead, blow out candles. Primrose, go ahead. Blow out candles. Happy birthday, y'all! Woo! Nice! Okay, Ramona, so you are mentally gifted, shameless, and domestic. That's cute. I like that. Good on you. Your turn! Come on! I know life's hard. Alright, Primrose is gonna be a kindness ambassador, frugal, and... I am the master! I am the master, grant supernatural control, command powers used on vampire offspring. No. 
Meltmaster. Meltmasters have devoted enough of their love and bodies to grilled cheese to truly become gurus of gruery. They can summon grilled cheese sandwiches and paint grilled cheese paintings. Cute. All right, next up, Amira and Aurora. <laughs> Happy birthday, even though y'all just aged up. How are you? Oh, no. <laughs> Okay, Aurora's gonna be a survivalist. <laughs> Survivalists are most comfortable using camping equipment and living off the land. So weird. Ooh. And Amira, I'm excited to see what your trait's gonna be. Potion Master? What? Potion masters can mix potent drinks which can sway drinkers' emotions. Okay, yeah, that happens at the bar, not at the, not like the alchemy. Okay, that's fine, whatever. Oh, look at that shirt. Look at this giant family. I love this. All right, Harry, you're gonna be an overachiever. I can see it. I can definitely see it. And your aspiration is soulmate. Hmm. Okay. Come on, Theodore. Socks with sandals. Interesting fashion choice. Happy toddler and a geek. And your aspiration is gonna be Renaissance Sim. All right. Boom. Where is Jackson? I swear we invited him. Why is he not here? Oh, why doesn't anyone like Talon? What's going on? Did he do something weird? Alright, that's everybody. Everyone is aged up, so we're going to be moving out Ramona, Primrose, Amira... Aur and Aurora. Okay, wow. We're gonna have quite the empty household. What is this? Chili? Oh, how cute! Ooh, oh, yes, we get to decide their life now. Since they're not gonna be um, in our household anymore, it doesn't really matter, so we can decide their life now. Okay, so Ramona, let's do Life Decider. Decide Ramona's life. This will give your sim a head start in life or a little history. Your sim will be given a career, bonus trait, skills, and extra income. The decider can only be used once. However, children will be able to use it again when they become a teen. Teens will not get a career or income, but you can use the randomizers when they are older. Okay, let's see. Let's see what happens. Whoa. She just got $22,000. Which we're definitely gonna take out, cause that's cheating. But, holy crap. Okay, so let's see. Bank savings, amazing. Your sim saved up 15,000 to 30,000 in their life so far. They have a bonus trait and it's attractive. These traits was picked up by your sim in their life. Career choice, secret agent. Uh, what else is there? Skill learning average. Your sim put in some effort to learn their skills in life. Wow! And then these are all the skills that she got. That's really cool. Okay, so we're gonna have to keep track of the money that we need to sub subtract. So Ramona gave us 22,000. Primrose, let's do your life. 18,126. Okay, and she got... Bank savings amazing, 15,000 to 30,000 in their life. She got bonus trait weak. These traits, she got a weak trait. Oof, okay. She got retail for her career choice. Shelf stalker. Wow. And then she got skill learning average. Okay. All right, your turn, Amira. Here we go. Decide Amira's life, 9,020. Okay, and you got bank savings good, 5,000 to 10,000. 
Bonus trait, Clueless. <laughs> she got Lifeguard as her career choice. That is so random. And she has good skill learning skills. So your sim put in a lot of effort to learn their skills in life. So yeah, she's got a lot of skills now, which is really cool. And she's a lifeguard, which makes sense since she wants to be a bodybuilder. It's kind of like an active career. So yeah, that's really cool. It like Instead of just throwing out the kids into life with nothing, no backstory or anything, no career, they now... Aurora has taken a trippy pill. What the heck? <laughs> Why? <laughs> Your name is Aurora, not Alice. But yeah, I think it's cool that it kind of decides their life for them. So we're gonna do Aurora now. So 1,310, that's not very good. So she got bank savings terrible, 250 to 500. She got slow metabolism as her bonus trait. She wants to be a writer, or that's her career choice. Um, skill learning bad. Your sim put in little effort to learn their skills in life. She didn't get very good stuff. Like old times from being near family. Oh, that's so sweet. Why is Mac here? I definitely didn't invite him. Okay, and it looks like the game is just like glitching now. There's too many sims on the lot. I'm gonna end the party. <sighs> okay, let's just, um, was there anything else that I wanted to do? Everyone else is, these four are young adults. These two we need to change and create a sim. Okay, let's head over to Manage Worlds and move those four girls out. I'm sad. We're not gonna have anyone to make us potions anymore. <laughs> I'm pretty sure this household is full. We're just gonna have to start another one. All right, they're gone. I'm sad. Okay, so let me just calculate how much money we need to delete from our household. All right, so our money is gonna be 5,542. Okay, that's settled. So now we need to check out these boys and create a sim. All right, Theodore. For skin details, which one did you have? This one, okay. And then your eyes. I can't believe I'm doing this again. I spent so much time making them earlier. Okay, yeah, you had this one. You had some chubby cheeks. All right, there you go. There's Theodore. Now to work on Harry. Whew, you need some work, my boy. Okay, yeah, I think you had something like this. If I remember correctly. I like his lips. They're nice. Should we give him these glasses? Level him up a little bit from the old ones? Or these? Ooh, these are super hairy, aren't they? I'm giving him this scholarly looking sweater with some Gryffindor looking pants. Oh, oh. <laughs> And some nice shoes. There you go. I hope you guys like Harry. Okay, guys, I'm gonna leave this episode right here. Please leave me comments. Let me know what you think of it. I love you so, so, so much. And I will see you in my next video. Bye!